Well, up YouTube, your boy Mr. Scam here, so I've got a little Apple schedule update, off, update for you. Uh, the American version, as you can probably hear by my birds, I'm downstairs. Of course, I don't want to be moving this Apple up and downstairs. Um, I do not want to keep up in my room, uh, to be honest, so I'm just going to keep it down here. Um, and until I can get it cut so I can stick it in the lock, so it's staying down here for a period of time. So, this is the um, similar setting where I'm going to be doing my Apple updates. And as you can see, there are, there are the noisy fuckers which are making all the noise. Okay, let's return to the arrivals on final, or, or near enough on final. We've got a Virgin America A320. This is just coming back from San Francisco. Um, then holding short on my 0 2. I'm trying to do this sitting down by not actually adjusting anything. This is unfolding. Um, then we got Air Force 2, uh, 757. Um, and this is going off to Washington. I don't know where it actually goes, but it's going to Washington. That's what I know. Um, then just holding behind that. Let's zoom out a little bit. Oh, there's my thumb. Or oh, my finger, whatever. Uh, it's been, I don't think you can actually see it really. Because it's on the wrong side. The light is the other side. Oh, I've actually got to get up and move around. Yes, there was the light's fault. Um, behind, behind, behind Air Force 2, we've got a Southwest 737. 700 in the Nevada um, Battleborn colours. This is heading off to um, heading off to Vegas. Then holding short and on the other hold point we've got a FedEx ATR 72 and this is heading off what are, oh man I keep why don't I move the schedule over here I've got like a little piece of paper which I'm marking off of. Uh, let's move it back. Okay this FedEx ATR 72, which is now on your screen, and it? it's not grass. Um, FedEx 72, this one's heading out to, um, what's that? Uh, it's heading out to Los Angeles. Then behind that, it's kind of this, at this stage of today, it's kind of a half push, half not. So half the airlines are trying to get all the aircraft out, but um, the others are just coming in. Um, here we've got a American 777-200 and this is going out to um, Essex International which is my other airport, my English airport, I've decided to call it Essex International because it's in Essex and I'm Mr. Essex Gamer. Um, so yeah, just behind that holding, it's a really long um, holding wait, which is fine for this Virgin America and it's going to be straight departures until these two comes down. Uh, here we've got a Virgin Eagle, Virgin Eagle, where the hell did I get that from? Um, American Eagle ERJ145, I believe, um, and this one's heading out to Detroit. Then, just coming to stand on another arrival, we got a Delta 737-900. Um, this is just coming from, yeah, beautiful model. Uh, this one's just coming from, where is it? Uh, it's just coming from Minneapolis, St. Paul, and we'll be going into Bravo 3. Okay, Charlie stands. Let's be finally on them. Um, on Charlie one, we got a little special one. This isn't actually a scheduled. It's more of just a surprise. Um, it's a Tupolev one two four, something like that. It's a Tupolev. Uh, it doesn't really operate anywhere. Uh, I thought I had it, and I saw it on eBay for like going for fifty quid. Um, I thought actually I might as well get mine out. Um, it's a Tupolev 154 even and this will be going off to Moscow via Charles de Gaulle I once again this is a rare flight it doesn't actually happen in real life at all um, and it's the only time it's going to happen in this one I just thought I'd get out because it's a really rare aircraft apparently according to eBay I rate all my aircraft um, on um, but yeah Tupolev 154 Hey, just push Charlie 2 is empty, Charlie 3 is also empty. But just push back from Charlie 5, we've got a Turkish Airways A330, um, and this is heading out to um, in Istanbul. Then the love, let's get back on the side of the light. Then the lovely new arrival, um, doing its first service today, the Alaskan 737-800 Salmon, it's a fish. Um, this aircraft is heading out to, or has just come in, no way it's heading out to, this one is heading out to um, Seattle. They could have at least made like, the fish eyes the cockpit, but uh, oh well, it's, a, it's an awesome livery, it's a fish. Um, wild, 
wild fish, wild Alaska food. Um, so if, you, if you haven't checked out my unboxing of that and five other, four other models, um, one other one is on this update. But if you haven't checked that one out, it's my last video I made, so check them, check it out. Uh, okay, let's move on. On Bravo Six, we have our US Airways A319 Battleborn as well. Um, this one has just come in from Phoenix, Phoenix Sky Harbor. And I thought I was to get that route out. It's just refueling, and of course, we'll be uh, heading out there once it's got the pressure on board. And Bravo 5, let's get back on the side of the light. I really hate this time of day because the light's just over one side and you can't move 3D around. Okay, we've got an, our other Virgin America. This one is the Virgin America 320, it's just pushed back. Um, and this one, this is heading out to uh, Philadelphia. Then Bravo 4. We got a United 757 in the older colours, the, um, I can't think what it's called, Tulip, I think. I believe that's what it's called, the Blue Tulip, whatever. Um, that's just boarding, and this aircraft is heading out to, uh, this one's heading out to Washington Dolls. I used to keep calling it Washington Dolls, but I thought that's actually not how you said it's Washington Dolls. Um, of course, I'm learning a lot from doing an American airport. Bravo 3 is empty, Bravo 1 and 2 are empty. Um, on Alpha 3, we got a FedEx MD 11. Um, this one is just this one's just getting cargo on board. Um, and this one will be heading out to. So a butch. Trying to keep it steady on two fingers as long as I'm off. This one's going out to London Stansted. And I always see this one coming if I ever go out to Stansted. Oh, it's sitting on FedEx MD 11. Um, then Alpha 2, shut up, they just had a little argument with themselves. Uh, getting food on board, we've got a Delta 777-200. Um, it's got a nice little gift, glittering I can see in the little Delta thing where I'm standing. Uh, really quite nice. It is heading out to Lyon in the France. And finally, oh that's because I've got my little flashlight on. Uh, hence the glare. That's why the battery that was probably dying down considerably. Can you actually tell the difference? I don't think you can. It's a little shiny about that. This is the final bit of the new the uh, American side of the new arrivals. It's a Lufthansa A340-600 spe uh, special secret release by Phoenix. This is just getting fueled up and this one will be heading off to Frankfurt. Um, I love this model. It looks awesome with those antennas. You can see them, which you probably can't. Let me zoom in a bit so I can get the antennas in. It looks really nice. It's a really sharp, probably one of my favourite 340 600 moulds. Um, this is my first real Phoenix heavy. I've got triple sevens, I've got the lots, but I haven't actually got a um, really got uh, two Airbus 380 Phoenixes for most of my um, Phoenix range are. Uh, short haul. My rest of my models are Jimmy Jets. Okay, this is the other side, you don't really see it. It's my bad side, you never really see this. Um, it's just the terminal and what happens at the back for a sticky So it looks cool if you look when you look down it. Um, but yeah, okay, that's it for the airport update. I hope you've enjoyed. Okay, let's look down to the final shot and I'll see you in the next video. Okay, guys, got a flight, for, flight coming for you soon. Um, I'll see you in the next one. Okay, guys, adios.